All right, guys. Today I'm back at the, my personal best lake. I'm gonna be trying to catch some uh, some big bass on my brand new reel. This uh, Shimano Scorpion 70 HG. It's brand new. Just came out. I uh, got it from Japan Tackle. It took like seven days to ship to get here, but uh, I'm really excited. It's a really finesse reel, so I'm gonna be using it for like light Texas rigs, uh, wacky rigs, um, drop shots, anything like that. But uh, typically here, soft plastics work pretty well, like skipping docks and stuff. So that's what I'm gonna. I just brought that one rod today, and I brought an extra reel just in case to get a bad backlash. But uh, I'm running 15 pound braid, and I'm using my um, Shimano Scorpion and the six foot six medium heavy carbon light. A bass pro shop carbon light but hopefully today goes well and i'm starting off with a wacky rig senko and it is in i think watermelon or green pumpkin color so uh let's see how it goes fish first fish of the day Dink. Oh, first fish of the day. Nice fish too. Keep him down. Man, if he's fighting, maybe not two and a half, but hey, it's a nice fish. More like a pound and a half. He's fighting really hard. That was awesome. I flipped it into that one stick. First cast of this lizard. I just made a switch. Now with the backlash. With the backlash, yes. Nice fish, nice fish. Nice fish, nicest fish of the day. All right, let's get him in. Dude, all these fish look so big in the water. Another same size fish, man. What in the world? They look so much look the same. I mean, they look bigger than they actually are in the water. That's a little bit bigger than the last one, maybe. Kept working that brush pile. Fade off. Catch them on this uh, light tackle is so much fun. Oh. Fish of the day, I think. That's a long fish compared to what I've been catching. Let's see if we can get some more. I'd like to catch five pounder, but I'm not complaining. This is nice. 
Maybe you can go out and catch a fish. Great day. The water is just like, oh, it feels so good. It feels like a pool. All right, hopefully we'll get back to you some more fish. Whew. Yeah, it's really good. a backlash and I got a fish on. Chill, fam. No, thank you, thank you, thank you. Scorpion, baby. I honestly lost count of how many fish I've caught today. And we got a fish. Ooh. Ooh. Pulling a little drag there, buddy. They're stocked. Ooh. They're stocked in this little shade right here. This is a nice fish. I'm trying to keep him down. I keep trying to jump. Oh, dude, that was crazy. When I set the hook, the uh, the hook went through underneath its lip and came up and went through its top lip, so it couldn't even open its mouth. Try to open it. I was like, what is going on here? It's a chunky fish. Same size as all the other ones, but it's, it's blast. Sharp teeth on them. Quite hard. Just having a good time. Alright guys, so a good tip when you're kayak fishing. Say that you know the fish are in a certain area, just like over here. I've been catching them left and right. And the wind, if the wind is blowing in that direction, you always want to go upstream and just let it slowly push you back down. And that's what I've been doing. And it saves a lot of energy. You can just slowly fish it. You don't have to paddle like all the way down and just around. You just go up there and slowly just, just keep coming. Just keep doing loops. Get a get a couple fish in loop. It's rewarding. Made that another loop, caught some more fish. I'm sure, I'm gonna catch more as I drift down that way. All right, guys, I'm, I'm gonna be out here until three. It's only 12:55, but I'm on my last GoPro battery, so I'm gonna go ahead and do the outro now. I mean, I'm still gonna be out here as long as I can with the battery. Um, so, just giving you guys a heads up. I'm probably gonna catch more fish after the battery dies. It's just Here's what it is. I went through three batteries today. Grinding. Another one. Oh my gosh, this is wild. I don't think I've ever seen anything like this before. Oh man, you just hooked me. Ow, man. Jeez, man, they are stocked in this shade, man. I mean, I know it's common sense, right? If it's hot, in the sun, 
common sense of them be in the shade, but I've never seen them so concentrated in one area like this before. It's crazy. Like this 30, 40 long uh, yard stretch is just full of bass left and right. I just caught a fish off that dock and I just caught another one. I'm not, oh my god. Right after that last one. Oh my gosh, this thing's swimming everywhere. Right, the cast right after that last one. Just got this one. Fish everywhere. Something about running, man. This fish ran. Biggest fish of the day. And it's time I meet it. He ran with it. I cast it over there, man. All of a sudden, he was all the way over here. I set the hook. I don't. It's crazy. I mean, that's the biggest fish of the day. I don't even know, guys, honestly. They all look the same. It looks so big in the water. This one's got some really pretty colors on it. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Skipping this uh, wacky rig underneath these trees. <laughs> 